Okay, so this is the day one of uh, me trying to do trying to do the 30 day push up challenge and 30 day ab challenge. I'm also gonna run. Uh, I'm gonna run at least three times a week. If uh, if I start feeling better, more confident, then I will, you know, kick it up a notch. So you can see, well, we really don't have any definition. Or any muscles to really be proud of <laughs> so hopefully you know in a month this would uh, this would look a lot better so I guess we'll find out let's do this Okay, so this is day 30, right here, day 30, um, right off the bat, what I noticed is that my chest is a bit tighter, a lot tighter I should say, not a bit tighter, and my traps, you know, see that tiny little bulge, yeah, that was not there before, oh my god, can't even see it anymore, yeah, that tiny little bulge, that was not there before, my abs, a little bit more definition um, needs to be done. You know, I've been, I haven't really been dieting. I've been eating chips and pizza and stuff like that. So I don't like diets. I like to eat food. So I've always been naturally skinny. Uh, that's what the running was for. Like I said in the beginning, I was gonna run every three days. No, sorry, every other day, every three days. So I ran every every other day, um, but that was just really for me because I wanted to slim down. The, the push-up challenge and the ab challenge was so I can actually get a little bit of muscle and uh, you know my you know my shoulders feel tighter and my triceps feel a little bit tighter my chest definitely feels tighter my back feels tighter so you know it's a it's a pretty decent workout the push-up challenge was basically uh, 25 push-ups was, was your first day and then you do another 25 so you add on a tw you add 25 push-ups every day for five days and then you rest two days so for me I would do it Monday sun or sorry Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday and then I would rest Saturday Sunday obviously because you know you need the weekend party the app challenge is a little bit less consistent with the numbers because it's four workouts that you have to do you gotta do sit-ups you gotta do crunches leg raises and a plank yeah so numbers fluctuate a little bit more than the you know it's for the push-up challenge it's always a constant 25 25 25 every day but for the ab challenge it's usually like sometimes your your leg raises will stay the same for like two days and then or your plank will go up like 10 seconds instead of five so that one is three days and then you rest and then another three days and you rest and another three days and then you rest so that's basically how it's done and I it doesn't specify if you have to do them all in one sitting but you know I usually I did them in one sitting you know I would try to do them like one right after the other now for the push-up challenge if you could do 550 push-ups because that's how many push-ups you have to do on day 30 if you could do that in one sitting what the hell are you doing? Make I don't know why you're doing this freaking challenge. So, yeah, that's what I have to say about that. Obviously, you want to uh, you know split them up during the day. Uh, what I like to do is split them up into three different types. You know, you got your standard push-up, and then you got your diamond push-up, and then you have your your know your wide grip push-up. So you know you just kind of split them up uh, throughout the day or whatever. 
So that's pretty much it for like the whole structure of the workout. Like I said, I'll leave a link in the description for both of these workouts. Um, if you guys want to go do them. This is not for someone who wants to get big. I will say that over and over again, okay? I'm not a fitness expert. Fitness expert? I'm not a fitness expert. Okay, I say? I'm not a fitness expert. I'm not a nutritionist. I'm not even a guy who enjoys upper body workouts. Hopefully, this video this probably wasn't helpful at all, but this is just something I wanted to share with you guys. And hopefully you liked it. Probably not. I'm going to put my shirt back on because... I know I have, n I have really nothing to show off here, you know, not like Ryan Gosling. Bastard. This makes me feel so bad. Remember to drop a like, leave a comment, and as always, subscribe!